to tell you a story. Uh, uh, we are going to tell you a story about two greedy brothers who are locked in a room with the spice of their favorite foods. The only room was they had to eat the food with meat and long spoons, hawking the spoon at the very end. They were so greedy they nearly starved until they figured out what to do. Can you think how they managed? During the special assembly, we are going to learn that we can solve problems together if we look at things from a different viewpoint and the two has a better than one. There once was a king who was just and kind and honest. She wrote his land fairly. The kingdom was peace, peaceful, peace, precisely and, and happy. The king had just one problem. His brothers, these two men, were cruel, selfish and mean. But above all, greedy. At royal parties, they would push, poke, and barge their way to the front of the queue for the buffet. Then, they would gorge themselves eating and drinking until they could hardly move. One day, the king decided to do something about these two awful brothers of his. In the middle of the night, the royal guard woke the brothers and marched them downstairs into a small dark room they had never seen before. Inside the room was a table. On the table was every kind of food you could imagine. There were pies and puddings, cake and crumbles, buns and bread, um, roast and roast tarts and rices, and this upon dish of tasty things. Standing next to this table having with goodies was the king, looking very stern. The king commanded his brothers that they must eat the food that the royal kittens had prepared for them. But they must follow two important truths when doing so. The brothers looked at each other, then at the king, then at the food, then mouth watering. Rule number one. You must only eat the food with the spoons I give you. Rule number two. You must hold the spoons by the very end of their tips. If either one of you break one of these rules, you will be tossed in the dungeons. The king then walked out of the room, locking the door behind him. The two greedy brothers rushed forward to grab the spoons, pushing each other out of the way. However much they pushed, shoved and criticized each other, the two brothers were unable to eat even one crumb of the delicious food. It was only after three days of trying, when they were weak with hunger and half made with frustration, that they came up with the idea of helping each other, only by cooperating, taking turns and carefully feeding each other, were they able to get any food at all. The next day, the king opened the doors of the brother's room and found two very different men inside. They had learned how to think of others, how not to be selfish and how to work as a team.